Okay, how's everybody doing out there? First of all, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal Edge Technology Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Unfortunately, today we have rain, so um, can't bring this outside yet. I'll have to bring it out tomorrow. We'll have 61 degrees tomorrow, so uh, it'll be a perfect day for that. Now, today I'm going to be showing you how you can take an air mattress, and yes, I said air mattress. I've done this before, but I did it with a roll-on, we're doing it with a spray, and we're doing it with our new uh, higher form or high grade technology and this right here is our sorry, Eclipse Invisible Ultra 4K Platinum Gold. This is our Platinum Gold. These screens were designed for weatherproof. They're actually all of our screens are weatherproof but this one's actually designed to take on a lot more wear and tear and it's actually uh, it looks fantastic outside so we're going to be doing some demonstrations on that too also on Saturday when we finish our inflatable projection screen. Yes we are turning an air mattress into a inflatable projection screen. I'm going to show you some cool tricks on how to keep it sturdy. Whether you're going to have it against your wall. I would suggest putting it up against the wall. Not having it out in the open. But you can get two cinder blocks. I have one there and one there. Two cinder blocks. And you can get some... Um, these, these are the cords I use when I tie objects on. Uh, bungee cords, whatever you call them. And you make a loop system. Like so. See right here? A little loop system like so. And what you do is you take the, put this back around here like so. Sorry about that, that came un, undone. I wasn't expecting for that to come undone, but anyway, there we go. So you make a loop system like so. And then what you do is you take your hook, you put it around the top of it like this. And then this right here will attach onto another hook like so. And it will stretch across the top of the screen and come down the other end and attach it to the center block. And then you might want to put a piece of wedge in between so the screen sits up real nice. But that's a good way to actually uh, secure your screen without worrying about it blowing all over the place because it is an air mattress. Now, we're going to be using the Wagner 150 to coat the surface. Um, and I prefer using the air mattress with the built-in compressor on the side because all you have to do is just plug it up and just uh, deflate it or reflate it, whatever you want to do. Um, so I like to want the built-in compressor. All right, so let's begin. And also to this demonstration, you'll see that the paint doesn't crack or peel. All right, so let's begin. I should have a spray bucket around here. Now my spray buckets is where I test my sprayer to make sure that the nozzle's clean because I did clean my nozzle just to make sure. And I'll spray a little paint in there. There we go. And we'll begin. And as always, I like to get my edges first. I got enough room here for my cable. So I got to wrap around this screen. So I like to do my edges first and then color the inside or paint the inside. Then I go around the areas that didn't hit, which would be the inside. Come back around.
Link it the middle. And there's no particular technique on how you have to do it. Just coat it and cover it, that's all. Alright. I think I'm running out. I think I ran out of paint here for a minute. I'm going to put the ca um, camera right there so you can stare at the screen. I'm going to open up my cannon. See how much paint I have in here. I only put a little bit in here to start. I didn't put a lot. And we'll put the remaining rest in there. I should tidy it up right there. All right, just putting a little bit more into the cannon. I didn't put much in there to begin with because, you know, sometimes I feel I don't need that much. All right, so there you go. All right, let's turn back on the compressor. Shake it up a little bit. Okay, coat any areas you might have missed. Because there's some grooves in here in the screen. Alright. That's basically about it. And you're done. That's it. Alright, so there is our inflatable screen. Now. I got. I can't do this with one hand because, like I said, it's a pretty big screen. So I got to point you at the water heater because it's early in the morning. I just got up. Trust me, you don't want to see what I look like. You will lose your breakfast. All right. Being nice here with that one. All right. So I got to pick it up on my hand, bring it over here. So, so I'm not allowed to see that part in the demonstration. But like I said, be patient with me. Be patient with me. right in front of the camera. All right there, we got a setup over there, but I just want to make sure it's anchored a little better. So I'm just going to put this piece right in here like so. There we go. There we go. Just want to make sure it's anchored in a little better. All right, so let me go back here and grab my paint sprayer because I caught some of this with my hand. All right, let me make sure. I got everything good. All right. So we're done. Sorry about the compressor all up in the camera. I do apologize for that. All right, so we're done. All right, so let's remove all this out of the way. All right, make sure I got this size up just right because I have this to fit my screen just so. So, as I was showing you how you anchor it, you put these along the side, like so. There's your anchors, right? And you take your hooks, you stick them right in here like so, right? And you gotta bring this around the top of the screen like that and that's going to hold your screen down all right so let's remove this all right and we'll show you what we got here all right straighten that out a little better all right there we go so let's begin let's get that camera back right a little better there we go So that's what happens when we coat an air mattress with our technology. So as you can see, it took me no time at all to coat my uh, my air mattress, turn it into a high performance projection screen. 
And this stuff is going to dry in no time at all. Make sure I got everything out a little better. Sorry, make sure everything's nice and flat. All right. Come over here. Lights on, lights off. Just to make a difference. Show you how beautiful that looks. And keep in mind, an air mattress, it's going to have little lines and little ridges in there because there's air chambers in the air mattress. So with that, you know, it camouflages just about everything. Turn it back on again. Lights on overhead. And you can just see the technology. And this allows me to be able to turn this into an amazing screen showing you that you can coat anything you want. Got to think outside the box when it comes to our technology. And this is the screen that starts drying right now, so it's wet. All right, just in case of my time runs out here, because I spent a bit of time painting the screen, I'm Kenneth Burr from Crystal Edge Technology Screens using Smart Technology Gain. This right here is our Invisible Eclipse, our Eclipse Invisible Ultra 4K Platinum Gold. What I mean, you gotta think outside the box when it comes to our technology, you gotta think outside the box. You can turn anything you want into a projection screen. Now, instead of you going out and spending three or four hundred dollars, for a, a screen that is going to be white. Keep in mind, some people say, well, your paint costs around four or five. Well, yeah, but it does, but it's very high tech. It's, it's, it's very, we tested our screens against DMP Supernova, a lot of these high-end screens, and we've been able to beat these screens. So by doing this, you know, or match, either match or beat these screens, by doing this, you know, it just shows that you don't have to spend thousands of dollars for a projection screen. With our technology, you could easily do it, and it won't cost you an arm and a leg. And you can coat anything you want. You won't be stuck with one particular size screen. You can paint a screen as big as you want. Let me get something right here. So I was able to, now keep in mind, if you buy a deflatable screen, it's going to be white. We all know it's going to be white. And with it being white, you know, the color is going to wash out. It's going to look bland. It's going to look ugly. The only way you can use that screen, it's going to be at, at, pretty much at dark. This technology is designed to be used around six, seven o'clock in the evening. And look at the angle gain on this. And keep in mind, you can take a king size air mattress and turn it into this. This hands down would beat any white screen easily. And keep in mind, if you had the ability to take a DMP Supernova and if it was a screen paint and coat.